The private sector can do a great deal by satisfying the basic needs and interests of poor people. For example, in transferring money, which was uh, two people on the panel were talking about that and are in that business, by providing micro-insurance, uh, for example, against a bad harvest, against a death in the family or a sickness in the family, uh, by providing clean water, by providing nutritious food. So there are many things that companies can do, but of course companies can do it sustainably only if they can make a profit in doing it. And that is where governments come in. Governments have to make sure that uh, the contributions of enterprises are in fact profitable to the enterprises. They have to create a regulatory environment in which enterprises can meet these needs in a way that is sustainable and profitable for them. Well, what was controversial, I think, among the panelists was how ethical companies can be and how profitable it is to be ethical. And so some of the people from the free market uh, side of you know, the enterprises, they thought that by and large it's beneficial for a company to behave ethically and I certainly agree with Mr. Osher uh, that this is sometimes profitable, so I may have overstated the case, but I think in many, many cases it isn't. So there are exceptional cases where it is profitable, and there are exceptional cases where it is beneficial for an industry to self-regulate and to throw out the bad apples, but uh, very, very often, I think, companies will face a difficult choice between being more ethical and being more profitable. And uh, again, that is something that governments and regulators can do something to make that conflict a little bit less acute. We need to think more about the rules and regulations under which the capitalist competition takes place and about the meta rules that uh, are regulating the political competition which in turn then gives us the rules that regulate the economic competition. So this is really, a, it's a two-level problem, namely that we have rules regulating the economic competition uh, among companies, enterprises, and then at the higher level we have competition, political competition, about the rule-setting mechanisms.